Hello, this video presentation is on power and energy. The matter is anything that has mass and takes up space. It means matter occupies a volume of space. The mass is a measure of matter. Matter is anything having different kinds of atoms. Mass depends on the number and kind of atoms. The mass of an object is the mass of an object regardless of where the object is. The unit is in kg. Force is the product of mass into acceleration, m into a. The SI basic unit is kg meter per second square, which is equal to 1 Newton in SI unit. Weight is the measurement of gravitational force. W is equal to mg, where W is weight, m is the mass, g is the acceleration due to gravity. The unit for force and weight are the same kg meters per second square or Newton. The mass is constant but the weight is variable. Work done means using a force to move an object to a distance provided force and the motion of the object are in the same direction. Work done is given by the product of force into distance. The SI base unit for work done is joule. One joule is equal to kg meter squared by second square. It means one joule is defined as the amount of work done when a force of one newton is exerted through a distance of one meter. Energy transfer causes production of force act on a mass to move. Hence, the work done and the energy is having the same unit as joules. The another unit for energy is calorie. One calorie is equal to 4.184 joules. Power is the capacity of doing work. It means the amount of energy spent per second, that is P is equal to dW by dt, where dW is the amount of work done in joules and dt is time in second. Therefore, the unit for power is joules per second. One joules per second is equal to one watt. The product of voltage and current results dW by dt which is the power. Therefore, the product of voltage into current is equal to power. The energy is equal to power into time. Therefore, the unit for energy is watt hour. One kilowatt hour is equal to one unit. Energy is available in different form. Technology should be found out for converting this energy into electrical energy. Oil conversion, the amount of electrical energy per second, that is watts, is important. Higher the value of watts, more electrical load can be connected. How a person is discharging his energy per second, that is joules per second, is higher means he is a powerful person, can lift the heavy mass. In reality, the unit for power is horsepower. One horsepower means lifting a 75 kg of weight from the ground level above 1 meter within second. How much of energy is spent is called 1 horsepower. 1 horsepower is equal to 735.5 watts. When a mass is placed at a height of h meters from ground level, it is having a potential energy of mgh, where m is the mass, g is the acceleration due to gravity, h is the height. 
Similarly, when a mass is moving with a velocity of v, it is having a kinetic energy of half into mv square, where v is the velocity of the moving mass. I hope this video will enhance your knowledge in power and energy. Request to subscribe my channel, post comments, mark like and share videos. This video is dedicated to professors Dr. R. Srinivasan, P. Brahmanayakam, those who taught subject on power and energy. Thank you.